Hi everybody, welcome to Swarm. This is a new roguelite, roguelite developed by Riot Games in which you play one of 10 different characters and try to become as powerful as possible by defeating enemies, picking up blue experience orbs that give you access to power-ups. These power-ups can affect you in multiple different ways. Anything as far as as far from, you know, giving you passive bonuses like more movement speed or to giving you upgrades and new weapons to play around with. Now, what are weapons? Weapons are things that spawn from the center of your character and go out and hit enemies. You start with one base weapon. That's my Meow Meow. This is Jinx, the character I'm playing's base minigun weapon. You can either choose to auto aim it like I am here, or you can manual aim it. Just like so. The other weapons, you do not uh, manually aim as far as I'm aware. All the other weapons, all the other weapons that you collect seem to be always um, auto aim. So you're, you're trying to collect blue experience orbs, which will give you power ups, make you stronger, and that way you can defeat bosses and things along the way. That should give us a power up. These are gonna uh, we have our choice at one of three passive abilities here. We can go experience, health regeneration, critical strike chance. And once we select one, it gets locked into our passive slots. I only have four I can get for the whole game. So once I get one of these, it's locked in. I think I might take a hit here. The, the passive health regen could be nice. On top of the getting these passive um, skills and more weapons to play around with, we also have... Oh, a Yumi quest. But we, but we also have abilities. So my E ability here, which probably will get sent, shipped over to consoles eventually, just blows up everything with a massive amount of rockets. Okay, and I now have access to one of three things. Here we go, a passive skill, a passive ability for my health regen. Full city, a final city transit, which is a train that, run, that rolls around and runs over people. Or ice blast armor, blocks damage freezing and enemies damage scales with armor. Very interesting. I'm gonna go for the train. I like the train, I'm a, I'm a train stan. So I'm gonna go with train. Getting collapsed on, doesn't matter. I have my ability and I have my Jinx passive. My Jinx passive is get excited. Whenever Jinx kills 75 enemies or an elite monster, she gains extreme speed and 75 ability haste for eight seconds. Ability haste allows everything you do to come up faster. Um, extra projectiles makes lots of sense, but I'm gonna go blade orang. I'm a blade orang stan. Let's go. All right, so I'm going to go down here and go to my Yumi quest on the mini-map. As you can see, I want to go gra grab that. I want to avoid this health beacon because it has a cooldown. Yumi quest has spawned. Perfect. I'm on the way. What is my quest? Quest maker, what is my quest? Tell me or I must beg. Push the ball to make it glow. Uh, glow uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'll push it over enemies. No, no problem. I think I want ability haste as one of my set locked in sk passive skills now in order for weapons to evolve then they need to be oh come on go faster roll over enemies yes it's glowing it's glowing we're so back we're so back we're so back come on i want to use it against this big lad it's not how come it didn't do any damage oh, oh, oh get me out of the circle dang i need i need movement speed all right, I think I, I think I got my quest done right there. Death and taxes. Enemies have a chance to drop several coins on death. Bite size. Shrink minus 30 in size and lose 20 max health, but gain 20 movement speed and 36 ability haste. Wow. Minus 80% pickup radius, but every 60 seconds, vacuum all drops. I think that's what we want. I want to vacuum all drops every 60 seconds. So now I don't have to, I don't have to worry about picking out drops. All right, so do we want to take a passive ability haste? A new weapon? Or meow meow upgrade. I'm taking a meow meow upgrade. And I am going to lock in movement speed as one of my as one of my passive skills. I think movement speed is really important to take. Let's get a little bit of space from this guy. And then boom. We want to use our alt during our our passive because we get the ability haste during that time. So that's so we'll have our alt back up faster if we use our ultimate during our jinx passive. In fact, you want, if your Jinx passive is coming up, you might as well hold all of your abilities. Movement speed is getting us out of there, no problem. A little bit poorly timed here, but this is what it is. Can't always hold everything. 
It's user lose it sometimes, like right here, user lose it. As long as you set up, as long as you wait to use your ultimate ability with with your Jinx passive, I think it's, it's probably usually worth it. I don't want to lock in another ability because I want to get the damage evolve ability on this train. So with that being said, I'm going to go... Oh, these are all new. I have to choose one. Okay, I'm not going to be able to get the train evolve. I'm going to go for... Max health. Crazy as it may sound. Can you use your ultimate during your passive? There you go. It's just that simple, folks. Remember, I don't I don't have I have the vacuum, so I'm gonna get levels up kind of in a spam succession. I think I am gonna take Radiant Fields. Or do I want Lioness Lament? I'm going to go Radiant Fields. I, I kind of want the damage around me. It's kind of like a get-out-of-jail-free card in the late game, I feel like, against a lot of these mobs, like the bats and stuff that I can't get away from. Okay, let's just use my E while my while my passive is up there. Okay, I, this is where I've, I've died the last several runs I've attempted to do a recording. Blast into the wall here. Do some damage. I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. Blast them. Okay, we're so out. Yes, okay. We're through that. We are through that barrier. That's been really rinsing me every single time. We're back. We're still back. It's only the four minute mark too. We roll. I want. I want my manual aim on because I want to use my three upgraded. There we go. Minigun to wreck that dude. I want to get to that card, but my drops. My drop radius is kind of trash. I have vacuum. Oh, use my jinx passive. There we go. Ability haste, that's kind of worth it. And we get vacuum, which gives us more. Okay, I, I do want to try this ice blast armor. Damage scales with the armor is probably not going to rank up with what anything I've got. In that case, we don't take it. I want to be as strong as possible. I'll try ice blast armor a different time. Maybe when I'm playing like Leona or something. Okay, we pick up, we roll on. Manual aim on. Okay, we do pick up some some uh, EXP along the way if it's there. If it's along our path. Getting a little bit cut off from existence, but we should get our Jinx passive when we roll out. Take a little bit of damage, but we have health regen for that reason. Let's get, let's keep upgrading our weapons. We want our up, we want to get our weapons to level six, especially ones that can be upgraded like this one can. Okay, I used my ultimate not in my ability not in my. Jinx passive. I wonder if that actually does scale the way I think it does. It might not. Let's keep going on the Jinx passive. That's what your you, you that's what your advantage is over other characters. You got the movement speed. You are the quick one. All right, that is static sword. Fires a lightning bolt that bounces between enemies with the highest crit. And it scales with yeah. I think that that's exactly what we're looking for. A little static sword to to round out our build here. We don't we don't need the heal juice. We just need the XP. Vacuum me. Let's go. Sorry, Transit. We, we can't upgrade you to the final level. In that case, I snooze you. More movement speed is nice. More ability haste is nice. Oh, man. Those vacuums are insane for XP, just by the way. Let's buy the rigmarole. I was like, wait, this guy's just good at League of Legends too? How is he so good at every game? I've always been here. Just hiding the shadows. Oh, I don't want to take damage from this lad. Yeah, it's right after talking trash, too. I've got three upgrades in my minigun. I, just want, I can use it to... I can actually use it to damage some bosses here. Here we go. Give me that upgrade. Yes, Blade of Rang is level 5, and I have an upgrade for it. I, I've, I've almost got the upgraded Blade of Rang. I need to get my passive pop in here. Blast them. I need a vacuum, please. If I could get a vacuum, that'd be great. A couple passives, though, goes off. Oh, yeah, no, it definitely scales the way I think it does. 100% does. Oh, let's go. Okay, there it is. The Evolved Quad Orang. Projectiles explode into fans and smaller missiles. So watch the as the boomerangs go out. They're going to be doing a lot more now. 
I think here we take health regen because we're, we're plenty fast. We're plenty fast. I think we just honestly want to keep our health up as much as possible. Okay. Don't worry about the, the power-ups right now. Let's just go ahead. Or don't worry about the EXP points right now. We'll vacuum them up in a second. Keep blasting. Don't wanna I don't need that I don't need the health. Give me a quest to spawn. Let's use our passive to get over there. Definitely blast these guys. Don't don't let these bomb guys go off on you. Oh yeah. We're fine. Everything is fine. Blast that. Don't worry about it. Can I get my passive please? <laughs> Playing Jinx without passive? What's my Yumi quest? Must, I must reach the destination within time. Okay, it's over there, that's easy. Just need one Jinx passive the prop. There we go. Oh, there's one. Oh, okay, another Coliseum. Okay. We go health regen here. And we, we, we just pray for the end of all things to be in our favor here. Choosing our target, choosing our target, and blast them with their ult. With their with their guns here, and we do make an opening and we're so back. Come on, get this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, we're, we're almost there. Boom! Ebb and flow. Okay, which one do I want? Gain 1% movement speed for every two ability haste. Grants or grant ability haste fluctuating between negative 50 and 120. No way. Ooh, reduce maximum health now. Let's take the let's take the movement speed and ability haste one. Doom, pum, 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 pum. Now I am super for super. Dun, 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 dun. Now I am super for fast fast. Yeah, so this is swarm. I'm upgrading my weapons. Getting stat getting passive stat bonuses. Playing Jinx. Ooh, as far as characters I have played, it feels like the hardest one to, to, to pilot, personally. But her damage, I feel like, can can really pop. I blast them from afar. Don't get hit by anything because we're too quick for you. We're too quick for that. And now we vacuum up all the XP. Let's go. I do want to get my Radiant Field leveled up a little bit. I would like to have that evolved by the time we get to a final fight, to be honest with you. These guys just spit. All they are is little Kog'Maws. All they do is spit. Okay. We're still good. As long as we focus fire our minigun, I think we'll be fine. I prefer to, to keep the uh, my regular aim. But I don't want the auto aim on most of the time, but sometimes it's nice. With a lot of characters, it's nice. <laughs> One character I haven't played yet is Seraphine, which she seems to be pretty cool. Her ultimate seems pretty nice. I need to find more enemies. I'm not, I'm not used to having this problem. Let's go. Go ahead and we blast him. Okay. And look at all the enemies are just going. They're just going bye bye. I'm trying to get. Uh, I didn't even get a level up off a of vacuum. Where are all the enemies at? Killing everyone I'm seeing. I guess I guess I am a little bit nerfed when there's fewer enemies, um, but they're bulkier. So I want to get more. Okay, how about bats? This is what I'm. This is what I'm spec for. I'm spec to kill the bats because they can. They, they've ended my runs a couple times. Get out of here, bats! All right, so I'm using my regular ability, and then I'm gonna get my Jinx passes to pop, and I'm gonna cast my all. So it does still it still does still have that 30 second cooldown. I wonder. I wonder if regular. Cooldown is calculated differently than ultimate cooldown. Hmm, I'm not sure. That's okay. Nice try, bats. Like, this, this would typically be an enemy that absolutely roasts me, but luckily I had them now instead of a little bit earlier. Here we go. We get vacuum, and I'm gonna take. I'm gonna go f try to get this this uh, HP field around me leveled up. This this orange circle around me. I think it could be pretty useful. Now we got like larger bats, like upgraded dragon bats. Don't want to take too much damage. Okay. This is getting a little bit spicy. Things get a little bit spicy. You have to keep 
I'm moving and just moving. Last one, past them. Yeah, a little bit close to the edge of the map. I don't want to do that. Yeah, especially if I get cut off in the middle here. Blast the direction I'm going. Okay. I think I might actually take this heal. Come on. There we go. I need to get I need to get some XP now. Use my ultimate. Just use them on cooldown. That way when my vacuum does pop, I, I get levels up. Level 4 radiant field. Let's go ability haste because the ability haste uh, scales with my movement speed. Which is nice. Now I'm just focused on not taking hits. That's that's all I'm focused on is not, not taking hits. Use my movement speed. They hit the, the health uh, quest is down. I Depending on what this is... I could get one of these done really easily, one of these Yumi quests. These are a little bit hectic. I kind of want to turn on the auto aim just to get maximum kills. Okay, just focus on not taking deeps. Sometimes you do have to take a hit. It's not really anything you can do about that. Oh, yes. Collect them. Come on, vacuum me, vacuum me, vacuum me. Yumi quest is spawned. All right, let's just, let's just go see what it is. Radiant field level 5, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, what's this Yumi quest? Roll balls into the goals, roll balls into the goals, got it. Um, do I do this quest or do I just, just let it time out? I have to, where's the goal at? I just gotta figure out where the goal is at, that'll be good. Oh, it's down, down below. Okay. Oh, yeah! Hey, can you guys chill out over there? How about that? How about we just all oh, chill out? I might be in trouble here. Oh, I got I got the evolved one. I'm trying to roll the balls into the goals. Can you guys back off? Oh my gosh, there's three cards in there. Ladies and gentlemen, we might have it. Keep it, keep these balls rolling into the goals, please. Come on, we're almost there. Almost into the goal. Yes, okay. Got one card. Uh, let's do... Fine, we'll take the ability haste one. The weird ability haste one. It, it, it has a chance to be, like, really, really good. Or really, really bad. Ooh, my ult kind of whipped there. Now we're just onto regular mobbing. Don't take as much damage. Take the easy roads out. Here we go. Get my vacuum going. To the chaos goes crazy. I think we do take. I need to start. I need to get some weapon evolved if I'm gonna be able to kill this boss. Is the only problem. Take the easy road out. Take the easy road out. Gold, as you collect it, is for leveling up your character between rounds. There are permanent stat upgrades. If you want to play Swarm for yourself, you can play it on the PBE servers. The public beta environment servers on the right games clients. Um, we get there. We get there. We swarming. Performing. Rocket. With. Come on. There we go. Get your get your passive popping. Okay, just regular mobbing, regular mobbing. Getting a little bit collapsed on, but honestly, my cl my close in damage isn't so bad. Okay, I think this if, uh, getting this upgraded static ship would be a huge damage increase. It's taking a lot of damage there, but we're fine. We're fine. Blast them and pass them. Oh, let's go. Okay. It's Getting a little bit spicy and dicey, but my movement speed actually kind of counters these guys. Oh no! Yeah, this is this this could be the end. There's too many of them. There's just too many of them. Re Rexai is spawned. It's not gonna. Oh my gosh! I live. Thanks, Rexai. It's like 
You are doomed to eternity now that I have spawned. I understand that. That's something I that, that much I get. But I know that I'm supposed to focus the tunnel down, I believe, here. Rek'Sai is flying all around. Ch another champion from League of Legends. If you know League, then you if you know, you know. If you don't get a clue. Okay, so I destroyed the tunnel. That makes Rek'Sai upset. Very upset. Vacuum comes in. Static level 5. That static level 5. We're going for that level 6 upgrade, though. A little bit of lag. Hopefully, we can make it back. We are, we're so back. We're so back. Again, this is on the public beta environment, so the, the lag isn't going to be... Or the, the realm isn't going to be, you know, as clean as it would be on, like, you know, 20 ping. 80 ping isn't quite as good. I want to get in a little bit closer, but we're chilling. We're chilling. Fresh leg of Finland and class feeling like we can do anything. We can defeat Rek'Sai. Come on. Get us there. Oh, um, movement speed. Use your rockets. Yes. Okay, he wants to. He wants to do tunnel gameplay. He wants to do tunnel gameplay. Fine. That's that's fine. We let him. We let him do tunnel gameplay. It's fine. Alt. It hit. I'm in trouble. I'm not in trouble. I'm so back. Yes. Let's go. And that's to, listen. That's just how it's done. That is just how it's done. GG's. If we take a look at our post-game stats here, we can see I did 4.4 million damage, and you can see the, the items you took, the and then you can also take a look at um, which upgrades that you had. And so it looks this one, as you can see, this one was evolved all the way. It has the little star next to it. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I like the game a lot. And if you, anyways, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, subscribe to see more videos like this one, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.